So just in case you didn't catch any of the videos with the parts that have gone on this thing, let's have a look under the bonnet and I'll sort of walk you around the modifications that are going to make this first drive an interesting one today. Okay, so excuse how disgusting and filthy this engine bay is. It literally has been smashing it down. I drove it back last night, so very, very dirty in here. So we've got a Tegua induction kit running into a standard throttle body, decided not to change that. Then running into a Skunk 2 Ultra inlet manifold. We've then got some 410cc injectors here the RDX ones, the OEM Honda ones. Then the engine is completely standard apart from some Skunk 2 drop-in cams. So no springs, no retainers, just drop-in cams. We've then got, not that you're going to be able to see down there, we've got a solid fab big bore manifold running into the solid fab super silent exhaust out the back. And this is a four inch tip out the back here. So this entire setup is running 254.5 brake horsepower maxed by Remain at race K. 